Now, missile, let's go. Oh my god. Now everybody, fighter jets in the Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020. They've been a thing for a while now, actually. One of the first add-ons, for example, released for the Flight Simulator were fighter jets, right? They weren't very good fighter jets, but they were fighter jets, right? And I mean, even these days, we've come quite a long way. We have, for example, this F-18 that is released by Microsoft, right? Now, when you buy the Flight Simulator or update it or anything, you already have the F-18 here included. And well, what can I say? I made a video about this plane already it's actually quite an amazing well plane it, again a default plane just added into the sim like that no add-on or anything well, this feature doesn't work but other than that this is actually quite a nice plane here right i mean you know there's a lot of things that you can do here we can now uh, you know actually fold the wing right there's the wing fold button does it actually work yes it even works when the engines are actually turned off yeah I mean, can we can we can we fly right we might just want to need our <clears throat> beautiful afterburners there we okay I think I'm getting kind of sidetracked here with this video, but I want to try this now. Great. Oh. All right, maybe the physics are a little bit off. But anyway, these fighter jets here for the flight simulator, they're quite amazing. We've now had an aircraft carrier as an add-on for a while now, actually for pretty much a year. Pretty amazing stuff, but there's one thing missing, of course, and that is... Well, missiles, yes. There's no way to shoot anything in this game, basically. And I mean, this is very much unlike other flight simulators. Here's, for example, X-Plane. I made a video about this in 2019. This is quite an old video. Here I shot a plane down, for example. I don't know which one it was. Oh, yeah, it was actually an MD-80. Look at that. This is actually, you know, the X-Plane flight simulator. A professional. Look at this. Oh, this is awesome. There's actually, this no is also a included point. plane. This is not an add-on right here. You just get missiles actually yeah, with dude. the oh, game. Oh, damn. I'm sorry. And well, I guess the reason why we don't have missiles here for these fighter jets is basically this whole philosophy of Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020 of not, you know, having failures, right? There is no engine fire animated and no, like, crash animations, right? There's nothing like a damage model here for the flight simulator to make this even at least a little bit fun, right? And I guess this is because of, you know, advertising purposes, right? Of course, Boeing doesn't want to see their 747 damaged uh, or, the, or Airbus or whatever, right? You know, you can kind of compare this to like those car games like Forza Horizon. They don't have it. Uh, okay. Great. Yeah, they don't have crash models either. Doesn't matter. But of course, there is a solution, right? There is actually a way to shoot missiles in this flight simulator. And well, guess what the solution is? Well, it's an add-on, right? We've got, for example, here an F-35 that actually has a missile projectile here. Yeah, this is in the forum. Now, the developers of this add-on plane are called Flight Sim Squadron. I actually remember them. I once made a video about them when the flight simulator was freshly released because they came out with some interesting add-on planes for the simulator. Anyway, this seems kind of nice indeed, right? I mean, you know, this wouldn't be the first F-35 release for the flight simulator. I mean, we've got this add-on right here that was released a while ago. And this is actually a really, really good add-on. I made a video about this. I kind of just noticed the F-35 is kind of ugly. But yeah, this is, you know, this plane that you can, can do the vertical takeoff and stuff like that. Pretty cool stuff. But anyway, never messing around. Of course, this plane cannot shoot any missiles, right? We need to go for... Um, uh, this one. It already looks slightly worse here in the thumbnail, but let's just try this out. All right, so welcome now aboard our F-35 that can actually participate in a war. Now, it doesn't look all that... You know what? After all, this is actually a freeware plane. You know what? This is actually great looking for a freeware plane, right? Anyway, oh, oh. All right, we're already taking off right here. Yes, of course, this is also a VTOL plane. You can take off, um, you know very easily but there we go very very nicely flying plane we can take a bit of a look into the cockpit and well we can already see there's a, already the missile symbol here i want to i want to shoot some missiles actually all right anyway you know the engines are working fine you know this is definitely not somewhat of like a realistic cockpit i mean just look at the flight plan menu it's just uh great but anyways let me try out now the main event the main feature of this thing by the way we're super fast and that is of course the missiles for that one let's maybe slow down because i guess we're going to be faster than our missiles now in order to actually launch those we simply have to press one button and that is the beacon button yes try this now <gasps> yes oh my god we just shot some missiles and there's some smoke something like that guys we have just actually launched a missile is it going to explode? I actually doubt that there's going to be explosions. Is there going to be explosions? Please, let there, let there be. Maybe let's try, try to launch something into the ground. Maybe that will do. Yes. Yes, it'll definitely explode now. 
All right, we've got some smoke that's kind of bugged. All right. Uh, maybe, maybe, maybe launch it directly into the ground. Uh, now, come on, launch! Ah! Right, that would have been an explosion as well. Yeah, uh, you know, this is actually kind of crazy. What the developers have been able to do here with this add-on, I mean, I, I seriously got to say, because, you know, again, there's no missile support, no explosion support. Jesus Christ, that's kind of cool. So, I mean, we, we, we've got to respect that, of course. But now, it's time to do this properly. Let's go ahead and actually try to shoot down someone else or something. All right. Listen, welcome to London. There's a lot of planes here. Actually, there's the right one in front of us. Yes! You know what? Let me go ahead and already shoot something. I don't really care. Right, we've got this plane in front of us. This is an A320. It's approaching the runway here. So let's go ahead and shoot it down here. Good. Now, oh, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah. That looked good. Good. Um. You know what? The airplane actually stopped. The airplane did stop. Maybe it's just broken, actually, indeed. And you know what? We can even start a little bit of a dogfight. We've got an F-18 here in the distance. Get out of my way. Is that like a protein powder? All right, here we go. Get out of my way. Are you sure you want to do this now? I mean, the thing is, this F-18, it doesn't have weapons, but we do. So let's go ahead and shoot, just shoot something. I don't care. Uh, let's look at that. Look at that. Look at those beautiful missiles right here. Okay. That's definitely, that's definitely the story of that target now. I don't know what the point of this video is. All right. And here we have apparently a bit of a ghost plane. Uh, look, at the, look at that animation though. Yes! Yes! Die, A320. This is beautiful. Here we go. Now, missile, let's go. Oh my god. Yes. This is, uh, this is a great video. I don't know what this is, man. Let me go back into hovering mode, which we can do here, I guess. Yes, look at this. This is gonna, yes. Look at this. Veto mode. We can now join our good old, you know, battleships down here. We've got a lot of them. Great, maybe shoot some more missiles right here. Yeah, this is actually really cool. The thing is, when I press the button now, I guess, the missiles are gonna return back. Right, and this is actually kind of funny. I just found this out. When you press the button once, right, it sends the, the missiles. But when you press it now again, it, it, the missiles come back. Can you see that? Yes! <laughs> yeah! Great! I mean, really, I can definitely tell they had some hard time trying to work with that flight simulator 2020. Seriously. Not very combat friendly or anything fun friendly. Just advertiser friendly. But yeah, what can you say? This is the closest we've gotten so far to proper war simulation in the flight simulator. Other than that, I would definitely go for something proper. Not even X-Plane, but DCS. Jesus Christ. It literally stands for Digital Combat Simulator, so I would try that one out. So yeah, guys, um, I'm a little bit disappointed in the flight simulator. This is an awesome add-on, though. So yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching today's video, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. As always, good night. Now, thank you to all my members here on YouTube, like Spice, Robbie, Middle Aged, Levi, Junk in the Trunk, Mubarak, Darren K, Oh Man, Moritz, John, Kelly Chaos, Death Rider, uh, Ragings, Noah, Yes Aviation, British Loser, One, Saturn, Cat, Sunno, Shadow, New, New York, and Jackie Boy.